What's up, buddies? Welcome back to it. I can't. I can't even pretend like I'm in a good mood. Um, welcome back to another episode of the Poor Man Road to Glory. I just went through the two hours of hell on the rich man. Uh, the entire idea of using a fun, weird team around two red players while playing psychomaniacs and champs is just not fun. It turns out. Uh, it turns me into a prick. Then it turns my chat into know-it-alls and you know, a chat that hates everything I do, and then the toxicity just builds and builds and builds, which leaves me right here feeling like a complete fraud trying to pretend like I'm excited for a new promo when I just am getting clapped in gameplay, which is, I guess, the place where I want to try and do well in. Nevertheless, um, we are very prepared for this new promo. I, I There have been leaks uh, all over Twitter, but I've been lucky enough where I haven't seen any of it. I think people in my Twitch chat have been talking about it as well. But I haven't seen it. So lucky enough for me, I don't actually really know what's coming. So exactly right now, I believe, is 6 p.m. UK. We've got ourselves 21 big packs. We saved all of our reward packs, uh, crafted all of the marquee matchup packs and stuff. So let's see what this new promo is. I might have to take like a, a little bit of a break from gameplay, man. We played like 18 games of Division Division 1 Rivals yesterday to try and get rank um, on this account. And that was a disaster. And now I've carried that stress into today and playing all my weekend league games on the Rich Man account. It's just, it's just basically pissed me off, I suppose. So I want to try and just enjoy myself here. We'll have some menu fun. And then we've got the Leeds game coming up pretty quick too. So we'll get back to try and enjoy ourselves because I'm getting away from like the, the fun of what I want to have in this game and just letting stress and irritation take over so without any more delay let's have a look at what this new rule breaker uh stuff is where, where do you, i think you go over here right item releases it was harry K why why is everything so broken go no i don't want you to take me to the store for god's sakes can i can i see the team yeah we got some crap packs but the rest are pretty nuts packs um how do I? I just want to see the team. No item release. Oh, there it is. Okay, so we have ourselves a Harry Kane with 91 pace. I wonder. So I have to have a look. Laporte's got to be happy about that one. There you go. Oh my god. Camera's got himself one. Dumfries has got himself one. Ocampo's got himself one. Raja Nangalin looks insane. Oh my god. Lorente looks crazy. Camera definitely looks good. Lazari looks alright. Um, Douglas looks crazy. Dries Mertens looks nuts. I need to like compare the cards here. Let's go, uh, let's do this. Let's do this. We're gonna we're gonna just have a look at the squad over here, and then I kind of want to look in game at the differences okay so let's go over to our squad we'll check out the team and see what players look super good i mean dude i'm using an even worse team on the poor man i'm three and three on the rich man right now so i can only imagine it's going to be hell on earth um on this poor man i wasn't doing very well in division rivals yesterday with this team so I, it's anyways let's move on let's move on from the irritation of me being bad at the game uh so first up harry kane Let's see what his upgraded card looks like in comparison to his other card. So, insane boost up uh, in, in pace. Okay. So, it looks like it's a similar rule set to, uh, to what it used to be, right? Some rules are meant to be broken. Introducing Rule Breakers Team 1 available. Okay. So, we're going to get two teams of it. Interesting. Okay. Now, in terms of his card, high, high. So, no change to the skill moves or weak foot, right? Which is unfortunate. I think Harry Kane should be a five-star weak-footed player. 90 acceleration, 92 sprint speed is insane, though. We might have to try this guy out on the, um, on the rich man account. Anyways, he looks mad. What a change of pace. Oh, my God. What a crazy good card, dude. Holy mercy. That's awesome. I, I, I love updates like this. I really do. I'm a big fan of it. Okay. Well, Laporte now all of a sudden is going to be a, the ultra meta god card that everybody would hope for um, to have partnering Virgil or Gomez, I suppose. Oh my God. Dude, he's so insane now. Oh, Lord. 
Oh lord, oh lord. Wow, dude. Yeah, he tweeted about how unhappy he was about his pace. I guess EA are like, okay, we'll make you happy. Plus 20 almost on sprint speed. And almost plus 20 on acceleration. Crazy. Not much of a dribbling boost, if I'm honest. Not much of a defensive boost. Not much of a physical boost. So, legit is just straight up pace. Isn't it? Unless I'm missing something. Medium, medium, left footed. What a card, though. Wow. Okay. Um, let's check out Douglas Costa. Well, Douglas Costa would have already had a lot of pace, right? So, what is the main boost on his card? Lower pace. Wait. Hold on. They lowered his pace. But super juiced is shooting. Oh, wait. Did they lower? Uh, weird. Okay, so that's the thought process then. Yeah, crazy shooting, of course. So pace has been lowered. And then dribbling gets a tiny touch. And basically everything else gets a tiny touch. But the main ones are pace gets lowered and then shooting gets super boosted. Which I like as well. I kind of do like that. I mean, he's still quick. So, I don't think anybody's going to be upset. 64 finishing to 85 finishing, man. Long shots to 89. Shot power doesn't move much. Attack positioning skyrockets penalties. Dude, I love this. This is actually random as hell, but kind of cool. Okay, let's go check out Dries Mertens. So, I'd assume Dries Mertens is dropped in pace too then? Maybe making him more of like a, a cam? Oh no, okay. Hold on, what are we looking at here? So Dries Mertens doesn't really make much sense to me. They dropped his dribbling. But didn't really boost much else. Like his, I know his shooting got a bit of a boost, I suppose. Okay. I mean, he did get a big boost in pens. Wow, man, look at the dribbling. Look at the dribbling on his regular card. 81 composure instead of 76. Huh. I don't know if I should even say this, but I almost feel like they kind of ruined this card. The dribbling is so key to what makes Dries Mertens good. I don't know. I mean, I, I, I either way, he, he's a cool card. He didn't get like a super, super insane upgrade, but still something different. Uh, Ed Zorro, Chappelle, Delivery, Anthony, Will, D-Range, Frankie, Productions, thank you. Appreciate you guys, man. Much love. Okay, he looks cool. This is one I'm excited about. Raja is so awesome in this game already. Oh my god. So they dropped his defense. So they basically turned him from what a lot of people would maybe try and use more as like a, a DM into like a nuts box to box card. Holy mercy, dude. Wow. Oh my lord. I And the best part is his defensive stats are still fantastic. Woo. Oh, I like that card a lot. I like that card a lot, man. Wow. All right. Raja Nangalan is crazy. Uh, we'll go look at Ocampos real quick. Uh, I, I would assume there's going to be objectives and stuff like that. So sorry to keep you guys waiting, but I kind of wanted to like look through all of this first. Okay. So what are we looking at? What's the main boost and drop here? Physical is dropped and passing is boosted. Is that what we're seeing? Yeah, his physical gets killed, and then his passing gets gets kicked up a notch. I kind of wish they did something with the weak foot and skills, but I, I'm sure there's plenty of other promos coming for that. Okay. All right, so Ocampos looks not as exciting as the other cards, at least for me. Lorente looks crazy. I'd be very interested to see where these cards settle at. This guy looks nuts. Oh my god. He will be one of the best DMs in the game now. Oh my god. That is your very own Kante in the in La Liga. Bro. 
Bro, oh my god, what a card. Kind of sucks that they killed off his dribbling a little bit too, as you can see. That's too bad because... Hmm. So his defending gets a boost, but they really ruined his dribbling, which is unfortunate. But e either way, he'll be an incredible... He's six feet tall, high, high. Hmm. <sighs> Weird player, hey? Weird player. I guess you'd still probably want to use him as a box-to-box, -box, right? But they kind of made him worse in terms of being a box-to-box. -box. Sorry for any of you guys dealing with the servers being down. This game is a disgrace right now, guys. The delay in champs is so bad because the servers are so jacked up. And apparently, people all over the EU can't even get into the game right now. Anyways, he looks cool. I thought he, for some reason, I thought he had medium-high work rates. I don't know what's wrong with me there. So that's my fault. Anyways, he looks good. Lazari, I, I don't know about this guy. Does this guy look all right? Maybe someone we use on the poor man. So they dropped his pace and super juiced his shooting. He's got decent work rates. And oh no, he's three star, three star, which is garbage and high, high. That's too bad. Wait, they just boosted his finishing and attack positioning? Not, wow, no, never mind. I mean, they did boost his shot power and long shots, but they're still kind of garbage. Hmm. I honestly do not know how to feel about this card. I don't know how to feel about this card. It's kind of just like a meh card. He looks decent, but I think the three star, three star, and the high high is going to make him like uh, maybe use maybe just use him as a right mid. I guess I, I in the in the um, in the Hakimi position. Okay, let's have a look at Kamara because I can't tell what's better or worse on his card. I like Kamara's. Um, uh, I actually can't remember. Is it Hussein Kamara? Yeah, this guy, right? Yeah. So pace gets dropped, and my god, do they make him a great left back, though. Yeah, what a card, dude. What a card. So he gets a little bit of a drop off of pace, which is not a big deal anyways, because all you need to do is just give him a shadow. Wow. Incredible card. Dude, look at the defending stats. Holy moly. I love this guy. I really do. I have so many untradeables on the poor man, so it'd be really hard to fit this guy into a team, but I think on the rich man, we're going to try him out. For sure. For sure. Okay, so Ka uh, Kamara looks good. What about Dumfries? What do they do with Dumfries? We need to get him for a Dutch, uh, Dutch squad? Let's see. So they boosted his... Hey, okay, so his physical got dropped. He's pretty tall, right? Six foot two high high is a bit of a yikes. Nevertheless... He gets a nice boost in pace. I mean, how about a center back? How about using him as a center back with a shadow? I don't know as a right back if he'd be that good, but oh my lord, bro. As a center back, I think he'd be absolutely nuts. I mean, he's still going to concede to counterattacking psychos, but... Crazy. I like it. Okay. And then finally, this guy out of all of them doesn't look that impe impressive, but let's go check out Andre. Um, where, are, where Oh, I don't know. What does he start as? Like an 81 or something like that? Andre. Is this, is it? No. Hold on. How do you put the uh, accent aigu, dude? How do you even do that? Benjamin Andre? It's this guy, right? Yeah, yeah. Okay, so a bit of a boost in... Oh, wow. This guy's dribbling gets jacked right up. Uh, depending on his stats, again, he could be a nuts DM. No? Could be an absolute crazy DM. Wow. Yo, is anybody else, like, just tripping out all over the place right now? My, uh... Weird. All of my, like, stuff is just... Tripping. See, he's high, high as well. So I don't know as like a holding DM, but maybe as like a dual fulcrum. Still looks like a great card. Look at those dribbling stats. 90 composure, 93 reactions. If you give this guy a shadow, he's crazy. I mean, you could give him a hunter as well if you wanted to, I suppose. Wow. Yeah, really nice card. Really nice card. Box to box, maybe. A dual, you know, in a 4-4-2, one of the CMs. Really nice. Three star, three star is a bit yikes. But other than that, he looks great too. 
Okay. All right. So there are all the there are all the new players for those of you guys that are interested. Sorry, I was on the wrong uh, menu screen. Just as I look back at it, there they all are separately. I would assume that the players are going to be in packs all the way till next week, and then we get a team two. Now, the fun part, the fart, the the fart. <laughs> I am such a child. The part that hasn't been spoiled yet is, of course, the objectives. There has to be a new objective, surely. That's insane. Oh, my God. And he is also super tall. Now, that's a weird one because it looks like they killed his defending but boosted his pace, right? Okay, now what do we got to do for him? Assist four goals with crosses using Bundesliga players in live foot friendly rule breaker classic. Okay, and then you get his loan card. Interesting. Assist five goals using French defenders in live foot friendly rule breaker, breaker classic. I don't hate that he's in friendlies, man. That's actually kind of sick. Um... French finishing score in six separate matches using French players in live foot friendly rule breaker classic. Okay. Uh, score 12 goals using Bundesliga players in live foot friendly rule breaker classic. All right. Win six matches as well. Then you get a small prime premium gold election player pack and Mukieli. And a 75 plus rated player pack where we got a one to watch player out of on this account. So those are good too if your luck is in. Friendly's game mode, that's a W, man. That's a W in my opinion. You don't have to take it into the sweat of rivals. That's a big W. And then, okay, so score game any mode using a midfielder. Purchase a player from the transfer market. Assist a goal in any game using a forward. Play two matches in any game mode. All right, so that's pretty easy. Um, silver three, gold three, and then there's nothing else. Okay, great. Oh, did they update teams too? Wait, hold on a second. Oh, no, you just... Yeah, of course, we don't get the win, do we? Claim rewards. Wait, do we get something? Congratulations, you earned event rewards. Wait, so that whole time, we get a 5k pack, and then the... the Oh, European... Power. So there's another one. Stake your claim for Battle of European Powerhouses. Complete at least one team event objective to be eligible for the event. Okay. I don't know what the new event is. How do you... Oh my god. European powerhouses. Stake your claim in the battle over European powers to complete all complete at, at least one of the team objects to be eligible for event rewards. So, Raul for La Liga. This is really cool. Schweinsteiger for Bundesliga. Okay. I'm using him on the rich man. He's very good. Del Piero. Why do I feel like the community will just I guarantee you, no matter what, the Del Piero one wins. I guarantee it. I guarantee it. Purely because he's insane in game. And I'm going to pick Del Piero myself all day. Now, if you're loyal to Raul or you're loyal to the Bundesliga or whatever, cool. I'm, I'm going Del Piero. Not only because he's sick, but because then we get him for any other foot friendlies we need to use, which is absolutely... Um, it's average though? What do you mean? The Del Piero Tifo is kind of a cool option too. I went Makalele. Yeah, having Makalele as like a, a DM if you give him a Sentinel is pretty crazy too. Rykard. A Del Piero for me, boys. Del Piero all day. And I almost guarantee you no matter what happens, Del Piero will win it. Okay. Um. Now, where... I didn't see these. Did you guys see these as a grindable objective? Where, uh, where, where? Hold on a second. Oh, okay, there it is. Oh, I guess I, I would assume you'd have to select it. So no matter what, we get a premium Electrum player pack from, from the challenge. So that's cool. It's not great, but it's not awful. Um, Play two squad battle matches in semi-pro. With at least four Italian players in your starting squad. Okay, we'll do that tonight. No problem. Uh, score 10 goals in squad battles using Serie A players. Okay, not a problem. Win five matches with at least that one Italian player that plays in the Serie A in your squad. Okay, so you should be able to do that in all... All of these should you should be able to do at once. 
assists using Italian midfielder in 10 separate matches. Wow. Okay, that's kind of gross. But nevertheless, this will be able to do just by chipping away at squad battles. So I think this specifically I'll probably keep in squad battles. Either way, I'm trying to play to Elite 3 at least. So, and we're quite a ways away. I mean, could do this with Del Piero in the FUT friendlies section, right? We, maybe we include Del Piero in the FUT friendlies section. Win five matches. What about these two doing it in the FUT friendlies? You think that'd be possible? I haven't, I can't remember what the, um, let's see here. I guess the rule breaker classic, it depends. Is it going to be, is it going to force us down a Bundesliga route? Anyways, it says five goals using French defenders. That is going to be effing annoying. Okay. Oh my God, that's going to be awful. Scores in six separate matches using French players. Okay. Dude, I, I'm going to say I love this though. I really do. Score 12 goals using Bundesliga players. Okay. Win six matches. Where did, where, where were the, where, I thought there was like a Bundesliga requirement. Assist four goals with crosses using Bundesliga players. Okay. So again, we can have Del Piero on the team for that one. Assist five goals using French defenders. We can have Del Piero on that one. Score in six separate matches using French players. We can have Cantona and Del Piero, which is pretty cool. Um... Score 12 goals using Bundesliga players. So that can be anybody. Any Bundesliga player. Win six matches. So I guess it just depends on what... We can also use Mbappe too. Oh my lord. The amount of Mbappe um, that are going to be... Uh, that we're all going to be up against. Okay, so we'll worry about that in a little bit. I got champs games to play. I got rivals games to play. So this is something that m I might even take on on like Monday or Tuesday for fun. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? I, I'm not. I'm not like overly fussed about it. We'll we'll chip away at it. Is there anything else? I can't imagine anything else new. Foundations is a dead mode. Oh, Stadium Development Two. Yo, awesome. Stadium Development Two. Okay, complete five matches in any fight game mode to unlock a background tifo within the FUT Stadium. Okay. Complete ten matches to unlock. Your main stand center TIFO. Okay. Complete 15 matches to unlock main stand trophy. Okay. Goal colors. Oh my god, dude. Wait, goal colors? I don't remember ever seeing anything from PAX having that. Anyways. Home end right trophy. Pitch patterns now? Complete 40 matches to unlock pitch patterns. Okay. Okay. Main stand. I, I love this though. I'm not going to lie, boys. I do love this. Complete 50 matches in any fuck game mode. I, I, I love customizing out my stadium. So this is sweet to me. Complete 60 matches. I mean, it doesn't help when gameplay and servers are a travesty, but. Complete 70 matches to unlock home and trophy. I love it. I love it. It's just something else, right? Did they add anything else in terms of like maybe grinding gameplay or anything that I missed? No. Okay. All right. Cool. Now, I believe there has to be an SBC as well, right? So, last but not least, before we rip our packs. Naki. Wait, what is this? What on earth? Earn a special rule breaker pick in Naki Williams. Which version will you choose? What? Hold on, how do you look at it? Oh, that's so cool. What the hell? Okay, so, one that gets boosted for shooting and pace, which I feel like most of the community will go with, or another one that's boosted for, is it dribbling? Dribbling and pace, yeah. Oh my god. Oh, but he does have a pace downgrade, I see. I mean, i not gonna lie. I'd almost be semi-tempted to go with the pay the dribbling one. Because if you give him a hunter, that's an insane card. 
I, I honestly, if you are going to do him, I would almost recommend you go with the one on the left, the dribbling. Give him a hunter, bro, and he's got 99 pace, pretty much. 97 acceleration, 98 sprint speed. And then his shooting uh, would, would go into the 90s as well. Two-star weak foot. I'm telling you guys right now, it doesn't matter. If you are someone that sits on the counter or just runs down the field, this is a card I'm sure you're very excited about, dude. The amount of goals I've conceded to a regular Inaki uh, Williams. That's interesting. Okay, so then what is his cost? I love this as an SBC. Good God, though. That is very expensive. 84 rated with a team of the week. So we're talking like 40, 50K there. And then 85 rated. That's what, like 150K? Something like that? Is it? Premium Electrum Pack. Jumbo Premium Gold Pack. It's 100k? Are you sure? Why do I feel like it's not 100k? Because you need right backs, right mids, left mids. Although you only need 60 cam, so actually you don't need like crazy, crazy. He also has outside of the foot shot. 100 to 150k for him. You know what, man? I, I, I feel like I'm going to argue for how cool this is and how original this is because already not an insane amount of people are going to do this but then you get to have a different one to someone else that chooses to do it i love it i really do i don't actually think it's, it's necessarily a bad cost once again on my road to glory i on my no fifa point poor man rtg where i want to stay liquid i don't know if i'm going to put 100 to 150 thousand coins of assets towards a two-star weak footed like la liga spanish player i just don't see but on the rich man account i'm definitely gonna get him i'm when we're gonna have some fun with him for sure for sure we will will you because the challenge is using red my red picks which is making the rich man road to glory not fun at all but anyways we'll use ibra as a red for the first half and maybe we'll sub on inaki for the second half ea servers are down really i it's weird that i'm on the servers which is kind of crazy is everybody off? I'm kind of chilling. Anyways, thank you guys uh, for all the subs and support as well. Alpha alerts should pop up now uh, in terms of audio. Shape, Maddie, Doko, Arrow, Carl, Callum. Appreciate you guys. This is cool, boys. I'm going to say it right now. I think this is great content. And if this is the type of cool... If picks like this end up being the norm... That's a W from me, man. <laughs> Look, the servers are a disgrace. Gameplay is a disgrace right now. It's a real mess trying to play the game, uh, but at, le <laughs> at least the content seems to be even better than FIFA 20. So this is a big W for me, man. Big, big W for me. Um, we already talked about that. Is there anything else? Rio set and any like grindable packs at all? Okay, no, but that's fine. I did all of these packs as well on this account, all with untradeables. So now we get to look forward to some fun which I'm pretty excited about. So we got a good chunk of packs here. Let me clear out the trade pile. The silver pack method was crazy. Uh, the bronze pack method was super nice as well. We did very, very well on the bronze pack method. Uh, very, very happy about that. I kind of went back to the bronze pack method. I got to be honest with you guys. I found the silver pack method not to be doing very well for me. So I kind of just grinded the bronze pack method for about an hour yesterday. Uh, and then for tomorrow, we'll do the silver upgrade packs. Because I have so many packs to open anyways right now. Uh, I just decided... I'm just going to release all this stuff. I just decided to um, just grind grind bronzes. They're, they were paying out very, very nicely. As, as you can see, we've done very, very well. So, also as an update, in terms of my coin balance, you guys will know. Uh, you can check my past broadcast, check my tweets. I sold all of my Inform Thomas parties for anywhere from 140 to 155k. So I turned almost 200k profit on uh, my Inform uh, Thomas party investments, which I'm very happy about. That took less than 24 hours. I knew the market was idiotically low on Wednesday, so I'm very happy. I risked it. It paid off, which hilariously just makes the profit back from the crazy losses we made last weekend. So... This is, once again, as a reminder for you guys, the squad that we're going to be using. I can't imagine anything's going to change. I'm using this guy on the Rich Man account. He's atrocious. I've got an anchor on him, too, which you'd think would make him better. But anyways, either that or I'm atrocious. There, that's also the other possibility that I refuse to uh, uh, to believe. But anyways, 
so that's going to be the team. I think we're still in a, in a bit of profit on Ramos, but nothing crazy. We've like tripled our money on, uh, or doubled our money at least on Renato Sanchez. So we've done very well there. Uh, I used this team for like 18 games hey, uh, in, in Rivals. How long do Was you it think it will games? take people to remember in Yaki Williams as a two-star weak foot? Well, it doesn't matter. I'm telling you right now, the two-star weak foot, If it, it, as I said when I was looking at Inaki Williams, so sorry if I sound like a twat, but I've already kind of covered this, is that if you play a certain style, Inaki's two-star weak foot means nothing, dude. If you're someone, which 90% of the community seems to be already, that sits on one depth drop back and looks to counter and then shoot across body, he's nuts. So to the sweats out there, that is a crazy, 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 crazy good card. All I'm going to say. I'm excited to use this team. And what I will say too is I'm not having the best time with 41212 on the rich man. So it'll be interesting to see now that we're going back to 442 on this account if I have a better result in the weekend league. And then we get to decide like what's going wrong in the rich man. Is it because I'm using too many weird players and I'm using 41212? Am I just coming up against easier or harder opponents? We'll find out. We'll play one game as well for this epi for you guys. I, I, I know that at least when it comes to weekend league, you enjoy watching me suffer so we'll uh we'll do that too but let's get into some uh let's get into some of these packs so this is just from the bronze and silver pack method these hey batch here. what even has happened tonight lol i packed mbappe day one and now tonight got cr7 and ucl nima like what even even smile stay safe nick gg brother that's <laughs> massive man you got yourself a that type of pack luck you should probably go buy a lottery ticket i feel like now, this guy isn't worth much, but you know what? Still think I should try and sell. For sure. Um, there you go. Love me some BPM, baby. A little, little bit of profit there. Nothing crazy. We got plenty of room in the trade pile. Once again, I'm going to be selling everything, so don't hate me. I'm going to sell until the trade pile is full. And then uh, if the trade pile is full while I still have packs open, we're going to go play our game. That is what we're going to end up doing. Uh, silver packs... These servers are garbage. It's okay. Today's epi might be a little bit longer because what, what we might have to do if I do have a lot of, uh, end up getting a lot of packed players and fills out the trade pile, maybe we'll play two games of Weekend League and then come back. So Armalik, I'll have a little bit of editing to do for this epi, which I don't think is a big deal. Um, so we're going to keep him because he's uh, League 1. Kind of a rule. Wow. The, I, should I play gameplay right now, man? I'm going to say, I, I would be completely honest with you guys. The menus are a mess, so I can only imagine how awful the gameplay is. We played six games on the rich man, and the delay hey, was batch. crazy. And I swear VVD I'm not price using that is as getting killed. I think he is worth investing in. Much love, Nick. VVD's price is getting killed. I don't know if gold cards are even gonna be worthwhile <laughs> at all in terms of long term sitting. You know, sitting on them. So someone told me that these sell very regularly, and it was getting mad at me for getting like discarding them. I just don't see them selling. I really don't. So I'm going to go ahead and just get back to the discard of those. That's a cool kit. Doesn't sell though, unfortunately. And that won't sell. Okay, good. No gameplay, don't do it. Or we could go do one or two of the FUD friendlies too, right? Why not? Go. Uh, why don't we can go do that? Instead, maybe instead of champs. Sorry, YouTube. But if the servers are dead, I'm just going to take loss after loss after loss. So maybe we'll go, uh, maybe we'll go do FUD friendlies. Because that way, if I'm getting annoyed, you just pause and quit. It doesn't really matter. Doesn't affect your record, doesn't affect anything at all. Okay, so we got ourselves a Bundesliga player in 500 coins. Love that. Um, what about you? How much are you, buddy? Okay, I'm gonna go with like 750. That might be underpriced for Luzuk. This guy's got great hair. Give him that. Sell him for a little. So I would say right now the silver pack method was crazy good yesterday. I think it's fallen off. Boys. So I'm not saying don't do it. If you're finding that it's doing well for you. Wow. Is this actually a thousand? Oh my goodness, it is. Okay. I'll bop it a little bit lower. Get the sale quickly if we can. Um, and then all of that can get discarded. The friendly is five Bundesligas and one French player. Totally accessible for people. I love that. That's fantastic. That's so great. Dude, I'll moan till I'm blue in the face about annoying gameplay. I cannot find a problem with the content they came out with today. So I'm sorry again if you're mad at me for being happy about that stuff. We'll 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 see how the foot friendlies go. Champs is a competitive, sweaty, delayed mess. So I'm gonna get mad no matter what. But in terms of the uh, oh, this is untradeable too. Nice. Keep that. 
not keeping the Galatasaray stuff. That is for sure. The Leeds game starts very soon too, so we'll be watching that on stream. So we got a jumbo pack. Look at all these packs, boys. Two player packs, we'll pop these first. Which Anaki should I go for? I'd be tempted to go with the pace dribbling one. A shadow then makes his shooting nuts anyways. I think I have him untradeable already. How can I get that? Hey, Batch. Oh, no. I got rid of him Unrelated for the Unrelated to FIFA, but the, uh, just a Market reminder, 320 SBC. conservative MPs voted against free school meals for British children this school holiday, and through Marcus Rashford's campaign, thousands of businesses and councils are offering free school meals out of their own pocket. Hashtag end child poverty. Dude, you know what, man? Marcus Rashford is a credit to Britain entirely. A credit to the world, a credit to the... Is that Fred? Wow. Is he... I mean, I, he's untradeable, but is he still worth, like, 30k? I just casually got, like, a 25k player. Yo, that's kind of cool. Okay. Alright, so... Mr. Negredo. Wait, he used to play at, what, Spurs? I believe? Rules are rules, boys. We do not get rid of anything untradeable. At least not until Project Team Beer. Once Project Team Beer and I gotta open thousands of packs, then we'll probably start discarding random stuff. But not right now. It doesn't start now. Oh no, it was City. It was City. Yeah, yeah, it was Man City. Sorry, my bad. Where do I put him? There's nowhere really to put him, honestly. Other than I would assume a gold two-player upgrade pack. I'm not gonna do this card. I just, it's, it, first of all, it's, it's not an 84, 85 rated player. Not really gonna do this guy. Because Shelney is tempting, I'm, I'm going to be honest. But again, he's super high value, so I guess it's just a gold two player upgrade we're going to do? Really? Realistically? Yeah, I guess we're going to do a, just a quick gold two player upgrade. You never know, man, if our luck is in Soldado Spurs. See, I thought it was Spurs. Anyways, um, so if I go here... Go here. Bang. Then. Uh, let's go. We'll stick to. Do we stick to. I don't really. I don't know if I care. Common or uncommon doesn't matter to me. What we'll do though is. Here we go. What on earth is going on here? Yikes, dude. I, I, Twitch is having a nightmare right now, guys. Okay, so I'm going to go with that. I'm going to go with that. Now, I know normally a lot of you guys would, like, probably stick to non-rares. And I kind of agree with that. But I'd rather... Put it this way. As an explanation, I'd rather use... If you're wondering, like, on your road to glory. what? Okay, what is Nick getting rid of? What is he willing to get rid of here? Um, I'd be more willing to get rid of off league rares than main league non rares if that makes sense uh i find like a bastoni will always have a little bit more value than an off league um a, a juke so that's kind of as well and, and these guys are untradeable either way same thing i'd rather get rid of an ito than get rid of a bastoni although todibo being a frenchman in an off league i think he's probably more worthwhile holding on to Anyways, that, that's where my brain is at. I don't know if you guys agree or disagree with it, but, like, this dude can go. This dude can go. Um, Brazilian, but, I mean, who really cares there? It's nothing too crazy. I think he can go. Although, actually, I think that left back is worth a little something, right? MLS. Turkey. Uh, you got a Lozano there. Russian League. For some reason, the Russian League is pretty damn expensive, too, which always confuses me. Let's see. Huh? My eye... Dude, what on earth is... <laughs> okay. We're fine. Everything's fine. It's a false alarm. I don't know what happened there, but something crazy happened. Something absolutely nuts happened there. <laughs> what was that, dude? It's like almost like a, a hidden event or something. Anyways, uh, I don't particularly think any of these guys are that crazy. So, there we go. Gonzo, back to the packs, boys. Oh, also YouTube. See, now I'm in a better mood. 
20 minutes, 30 minutes away from gameplay, and I, I'm, I'm feeling back to my normal self. My god, man. What competitive FIFA does to my mood and my overall, like, life uh, outlook is kind of embarrassing, considering my age. But anyways, we move on. Um... There's something else I want to talk about. Oh, I noticed on YouTube. So the question of the day last episode, I read through all of your guys' comments, was as to whether or not you wanted me to keep like me grinding SBCs uh, in the episodes. And I think what a lot of you guys were saying is, yes, you, you want the SBCs actually to be in the episodes, unless it's like insanely boring, where I'm like stuck on one SBC for 20 minutes. But like where like an SBC like that, you ca you guys want to keep it in. So I think Armalika and I are going to take note of that. If I'm chipping away at, uh, at new SBCs, we'll keep them in there. If I'm stuck on an SBC for an extended period of time, then we'll cut out the dead part. And then gameplay as always, I think I'm going to stick to, we'll show you guys the squad. And then at the end of the game, I'll highlight uh, the goal scored and conceded, like in the 90th minute. That way it keeps things clean. And at least you get to see uh, goals scored and otherwise. All right, so we got a mixed player pack. I think these are all untradeable. Yeah, I, I, it's weird. I, I almost feel bad for you guys that aren't able to log in. For me, I, I, I have absolutely no issues at all. Leeds game is in an hour and 20 minutes. Okay, so not a rare gold. What do we got ourselves here? Uh, soccer god, thank you. Flashy, thank you. Yes. Ooh, tradable. <laughs> oh, they've dropped off the face of the earth. Oh, well. That's okay. My god, these guys were extinct at 11k. Okay. <laughs> How much are you, Mr. Guzman? Yes, please. Don't mind if I do. Lightning and bow, thank you guys as well. Okay. You do need a Portuguese player in one of the SBCs, right? But you can use bronzes and silvers. So bronze and silver Portuguese players, I think, are quite a bit of money. But not necessarily the gold ones. 40 minutes and still the servers are down. Now, this is... Hold on. That's La Liga, right? I believe. So at rules, same rules as always, boys. We keep the main league silvers and bronzes because we want to be prepared for league SBCs. Of course. That's not worth much, but I think I should still get 700 for Charles. I don't think any of these guys. There are center backs, though. Yeah, never mind. I could sell them for 200, but we've got a lot of packs open, so I don't want to fill the trade pile. Same thing. I could probably sell that guy for 200. Nah. Okay, we'll store all those dudes. Perfect. All right. I didn't know that was tradable. I don't even remember what the hell pack I got that from or what, what SBC I got that one from. So, gold two-player pack. This was from the Crafted Soldado. Did taking the time to not discard him? No, it didn't really pay off. Unless there's another good, like, non-board player. Alright, 82 rated. Trading a Soldado for an 82 rated left back. Uh, plus a couple of other untradeables. Not the greatest return, but hey. I think it's still, I think it's still worthwhile. It makes it a little bit more fun, right? Um... So, a small prime, I guess we go with next, right? I do not remember for the life of me where I got these from, honestly. Go bid on players people can't get on. I don't really care. I, I, I really don't, boys. Soldado. Whatever his name was, you know, the guy that I got. Is he untradeable? Is this an untradeable pack? Oh, nice. Okay. Well, the good news is, too, here, we got ourselves another League um, player. Okay. Right. Good. I put $94 on leads. Oh, God, dude. This guy is 1,300 coins as an 83 from the Prem. See, I'm all for being liquid. But when there's something like that, I feel like it's idiotic to sell. I might as well, I don't need 1200 coins, so I might as well sit on this, right? Because inevitably there will be a point where his price will go up. So that's another thought process in terms of how I run my liquid no FIFA point RTG, if you guys were wondering. I, if you're sitting there thinking, wait, I thought Nick sells everything. I do, but if there's 83s and 84s that are damn near discard, I just keep them. Because I find it kind of silly 
to get rid of. I'd, I'd rather sit here selling this guy, man, for almost the same price as an 83. Instead of sitting on this guy in my club, I'll take the money for him, and then I'll just keep the 83. At least that's the way I'm I'm looking at it. I don't know if it's the right way to look at it. Unbreakable, Luki, Lightning, Bow, Soccer, Flashy. Thank you guys. Appreciate you. All right. My God, do we have some sexy packs to open? Holy moly! All right. What is this? A premium mixed player pack, right? I mean, well, there's no board, so nothing great there. Servers are down for most people right now. Boylan, thank you. Appreciate you. Alrighty, so let's move this all down. Um, another leak uh, player, and then everything else we can look to sell on. So Mr. Hadabor, he is near discard, but we still try and get the cash where we can. Servers seem to be back up. There you go. If you guys aren't able to get on, servers might be, like, kicking back up for you guys. This is a straight-up discard, but that's okay. <laughs> uh, instead of 300 coins discard, hopefully we can get, you know, 400 or something. No, they're not? Oh. Alright, false alarm. Sorry, guys. Six hundo for him. I love this promo right now. I mean, me too. I feel bad that the servers are a mess for you guys, though. That's really silly. So, I feel like, was it because I was on the servers already is why I'm on? Is that is that what you guys are... Maybe you guys just were trying to jump on the servers? Whereas I was kind of already on them? See, this guy being a rare for two 300, I always feel like rares have a, hey, have a chance of rocketing up. So, I'm going to hold on to him. I really need to get rid of him. No, I'm not going to sell him. There's no real point. Two weeks into Weekend League and imagine they both get extended. Disgusting. Tell you what, I'm not playing champs on a Monday again. I, I, I Yeah, it was a bit crazy me playing, what was it, like 25 games on Sunday last week. But it was so nice to have my day off, man. On the Monday. Catch up on a little bit of like menu grinding while watching football. It was lovely, dude. I mean, Steph went on a nice walk, and I just didn't have to deal with competitive FIFA. I, I loved it. I'm not going to let champs being extended ruin my Mondays. French. I didn't... S oh. oh. Unlucky. Alright, so so far all these safe packs haven't really netted us anything. Rule breakers are basically the same concept as Scream. Yeah, I, I, I think it was just rebranded. That's all. Okay, so real quick... Oh, absolutely nothing there. Uh, so I would assume Mandanda is near discard too, right? Or like a thousand coins? Yeah, so again, we keep him. Gigi Buffon, I am not that interested in holding on to. I'd rather try and get a little bit of money. I can always go buy him, right? If I need him for a random SBC, considering he's so cheap, we can always go buy him if we want to. Servers went down for the first promo. Can't even wait for team of the year. Wait, hold on a second. Is he actually 5k or is this someone? No, okay. It's someone trying to price fix. Or I don't know what the heck someone is doing there on the first page. Johnny, Johnny. Yes, Papa. Get 500 out of Johnny. Better than Scream in my opinion. I mean, I, 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 lo I, lo I like it. I like it. I, I don't know how else to like avoid repeating myself, but I, I do like it. I'm a fan. I'm a fan of the new promo. If, if this is kind of like the route they're going now for the rest of the year, we've got a, at least a fun year of content to look forward to. And then the best part is that it looks like the... Oh, my. The unlockable content looks like... Hopefully, we can get like maybe... What do you think? 2200 for a table? He looks very good as a silver, by the way. No, I think he's just expensive because of the silver uh, objectives. Anyways... I, I, I'm, I, we got at least, uh, at least we got fun friendlies to look forward to. Sure, it's skill-based matchmaking, which is kind of a nightmare, but at the very least, you can just pause and quit. If someone is playing like an absolute psychomaniac, and I feel like a lot of the times you'll come up against someone that might be willing to like do the objectives with you too. All right, maybe we get like 450 out of him too. What an absolutely Viking warlord beard you have, sir. Beautiful. 
Absolute respect hey, for that, Paul, man. Nick Baby, do you know if Nuka strikes are happening again? My charity stream starts tonight and don't want to get banned, so wondering you opinion? There's no opinion. It's it, it absolutely is, dude. There's no more music being played on Twitch, man. Absolutely no more music being played on Twitch, brother. Unless you value your ch channel. If you don't value your channel, then play whatever music you want. And play Russian roulette with your career, I suppose, but... Yeah, no, it's unfortunately it's the end. Until uh, I'm using Amazon Music and, and my partnership with Twitch and stuff like that. That's what I'm doing. Uh, it took me a while to get everything set up on stream, but uh, it's all good. And then unfortunately, no clips are allowed on my channel and I have to delete past broadcasts. It sucks, but that's the world we live in, man. That's the music industry, you know, um, and it is what it is. We got to play by, by by the rules. I would ha The best part is too... I would happily, I'm not sitting here trying to do, oh, Papi Bielsa, I'm not sitting here trying to get anything for free. I would happily pay music artists, etc., for like for the rights to play their music on stream. I'm lucky enough where this is a relatively successful career, let's say, and I would, I would love to pay for rights to any, whatever, whatever the case may be, but that's not even an option unfortunately so until twitch or amazon or the industry itself adjusts and makes changes we're kind of stuck with like the amazon music elevator stuff but i'm not gonna lie today on stream we did find some pretty great music didn't we some of the songs hey stop me from getting absolutely destroyed in fun chaps, Nick, but do you know if the mukiel objective is accessible via coop also, good luck in so. champs and to leads today. No, I, Put I, money I don't, on the Bamford goal and the Leeds win. Ooh, Zabi, ooh. Hey, Batch. Yeah, I don't, uh, I don't, I don't, uh, Reckon I, don't I so. could use copyright free music and I should be okay? I, well, I would assume so, yeah. <laughs> but then you don't know what's copyright and what isn't. So, I would use Twitch's, uh, sound, what is it called? SoundCloud? Or Twitch came up, uh, come up with it. Soundtrack by Twitch. It's something that, uh, they'll be adjusting and updating and, and, you know taken care of i'm using it right now uh, it's not great but it's in the beta right so you're just hoping look i trust everything amazon and twitch hey, do. they've been pushing the boundaries forever and making this website amazing so i i i'm sure eventually things will uh will get but do i really want to sit here on these right now i'm kind of willing to like quick sell them i'm not against quick selling the contracts for like 200 coins a pop, is it worth jamming up my trade pile? These are 200 as well. I, I, let's list this up because I actually don't know if it sells or not. Keep to sell later. I don't like having these in my club. Okay, fine. I'll sell later. Don't let me end the stream today without listing out my contracts. I want my club to be as clean and crispy as ever. I won't be able to sleep tonight knowing there's random garbage contracts sitting in my club that I could sell. Does that make me a psycho? Probably. Gladback Club Anthem? Like, does this stuff sell? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'll list it. We'll try. Also, reverse that. You can actually let music artists sponsor your channel. They would love to have you listening to their music and pushing your... Well, that's absolutely it. Like, what I love about the music industry is they think it's like a, 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 a one-way street. The amount of people that are fans of some of my favorite bands now um, that they heard for the first time on my channel is is crazy dude it's crazy and it benefits everyone it's very similar to video games do anybody at ea think they would be making this many millions of dollars hey, and their batch. games would last all year long okay if it brother have a good rest of your stream the, i'm off to get started and long? ready for my very no. long 48 hours all right vendetta have a good stream bro good luck buddy Try to get some sleep if you can, man. And don't, don't kill yourself. Team sleep, brother. Sleep is very, 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 very important. Very, very. Let me in. I want to open bronze packs. Okay, so we got a rare Electrum. Three Megas. Two 50Ks. A 25K. A mini 50k, a prime, and two 25ks. Oh, baby. We got the packs, boys. I'm sure I'm not going to get anything from them. But nevertheless, we're still making coins. No board, no walkout. Cool! 
<laughs> Luke Shaw, huh? Okay. Would have rather tell us, but that's fine. Uh ooh, pack within a pack? Oh <laughs> it's, it's a contract pack. I got sold a lie, dudes. Nice. So Luke Shaw is damn near discarded. That's heartbreaking. Toasty, thank you for the 32 Habibi Team Sleep. Thank you. Suso, damn near discard as well. Uh, I believe this Argentinian PSG, yeah, Paredes sells for a bit, right? Nope. My god. Hey, now's the time to do the advanced SPCs, boys. Everything is on the floor. Spend 10 minutes doing the loyalty glitch. And you've got yourself some insane packs you could open for this uh, for this new promo. Alright, so I said I was going to save these for later. Um, sell that now, just because I know it'll sell. Coral Spring. Do these? Do these sell? Uh, uh, discard. We move. Sometimes they do. I feel like like the nice ones sell. I don't know about those though. Okay. We got primes, we got premiums, we got rare player packs, we got megas, we got a stupid mixed contracts pack. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> uh Swift Team Sleep, there you go. Perfect, perfect, perfect timing. All right, let's get these 25k's open. If we could have connected to the servers. No board, no walkout on the 25k player pack. Good God. Okay. Le Comte. Is this untradeable? I think this one is untradeable. It is. Okay. Per well, luckily for me, no dupes. See, even when I don't hey, want to be untradeable, I inevitably have hundreds of What playlist of were you using players. in the Twitch soundtrack earlier today? I don't know, bro. It was kind of lit TBH, and also, how did you set it up on Streamlabs? Uh, you gotta figure that out for yourself, brother. I can't walk you guys through it. I, I am a boomer when it comes to technology, and I it took me some time, and I spent a couple hours and sorted it out myself. Walk out! England? Right mid. Is that a Jaden Sancho? All right, Jaden. He's coming to Leeds next year, boys. Holland and Jaden are coming to Leeds. Then help us get Premier League, uh, Premier League football. Well, hopefully, we'll still be there. They'll help us get Champions League football. They're definitely gonna come. He's 15k. We well, gotta spoil my happiness, dude. I don't care. I think this is untradeable. So we've got yet another Bundesliga player, which we can use, I think, in the objective team. Right? Why are you happy? Hey, man! Holy! <laughs> Get shit on when I'm frustrated in Weekend League. Get shit on when I'm happy with promos. Get shit on when I'm happy with, with pack pulls. Get shit on when I'm not happy with pack pulls. Can a man win? I guess not. Moving on! He looks great in a Leeds kit, though. EA Sports. Oh. What in the fuck is this game? Oh, he's tradable! And we're demonetized. Um, okay. Wait, he actually is 15k. What the hell? Wait, straight up, he's 15k. That's so weird. Why? He's so cheap. Hey, back. Damn it, dude. Nick, I have been watching you for a long time now, and you are an inspiration. My family and I watch you every charity stream and try and stay up with you as we lost a few family members to cancer. We love what you do and we love you. Thanks for making us smile through the hard times. Hey man, considering how much of a twat I was earlier today from Fut Champs gameplay, I appreciate you saying that man, it means a lot. I feel pretty guilty at getting angry um, at Champs earlier, so I've been kind of down on myself like a little batch. At least internally, obviously. I'm trying not to show that to you guys, but I feel like super, super sad that I was such a batch earlier. Like, everything I don't want to be. Um, these last six games of champs have gotten me to be, which is kind of why I'm only playing champs, like, for uh, fun, if you will. <laughs> we all get angry over a game. I know, man, but it's just like... I need to move past it. Same thing, like, oh, but don't worry. People are attacking you and being what? It's like, I just need to just ignore it, you know? 
and then to just take it out on other people it's just like bro I, I need to i need to realize my place i need to realize how fortunate i am kind of just move on so anyways i apologize boys I think Trophy might not be here anymore. I don't know if John Jets might be here anymore. There's a bunch of other guys too that got fisted, but I went back and unfisted everybody. So apologies hey, to anybody that got fisted verbally Hope or via. Hope you and the family are all well. Keep safe, buddy. Thanks, Barking. Appreciate it, man. Much love. Elliot, thank you. Appreciate you. I do know stage two of the stadium is out. Yeah, we, we checked it out while everybody was yelling at me to go look at SBCs. Because I was taking too long. Okay, so. I think we still got a little bit of room, boys. Let's get this rare Electrum. We're going to, by the way, we're opening all of these. Don't think I'm not opening all of these. But like I said, we, we trade Paul's getting a bit jacked up. So, another walkout! Oh my god, please! Oh! Oh god! I thought we hit the big one! I mean, I'm still happy! Koulibaly's nuts! Oh! Sway might be a beta batch, but he's a happy beta batch. Oh, I'm sorry I'm not that! Thanks for making me feel worse, dude! Hey, Nick, after all that you said, I want you to know that Sway's always happy. Okay? <laughs> Check Mookie Ellie's Twitter. Wait, did he troll EA? Please tell me he trolled EA. Did he? <laughs> Dude, I love this. <laughs> Yo, this is Mookie Ellie himself. Hopefully, I'll pack myself because there's no way I'm doing all this to play with me. Good luck, hey, y'all. <laughs> I want to buy my controller card, in man. half cores of the rage on this game and the sweats, but as much as we insult this game, it brought us all together. That's At unreal. least I believe that stops right. me from crying after conceding to Mbappe N28 lul N28 lul N28 lul. Oh, and he's tradable as well, dude. Oh my god, my pack luck is insane. Let's go, boys. Nikki's only 31k. Okay, sorry. Sorry for being happy. Ooh. How much is he actually, though? He's 4K? Oh, hell yeah, dude. I think this is from Division Rivals. This is tradable. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think, wasn't Jaden as well from Division Rivals Rewards? Yeah, I believe this was. Okay, wait, what? how much is he actually? Like 59? I really want to use this card, but once again, I can just buy them whenever I want to use them. So I'm just going to take the money where and how I can. I think player prices are pretty pretty nuts right now. Um, I'm going to put a minimum on him too with how broken the servers are. Okay, so. He's... Uh, I think I'm going to hold him too. Honestly. Damn, UCL cards have crashed, huh? All right. <laughs> Lineup released for leads. So did Pascal Stroik, is Pascal Stroik in Calvin's spot? I think uh, there's no replacement for Calvin Phillips, of course, but I think uh, Bielsa was talking earlier this week about using Stroik as like the, the holding DM. Yeah? Yeah, I thought so. Yeah, I guess there's, there's no real surprise there. All right, so then who's at the back with Robin Kosh? Because I, I believe Cooper's injured too, right? Alioski's left back. And then what, Dallas is in? Ailing's at center back. Oh, that's kind of spicy. So what, Dallas on the right? Huh. Interesting. Okay. So Ailing and Koch together, and then Dallas on the right, and then which makes sense. Dallas is right-footed. Um, okay. Cool. Love that. How's our trade pile looking? I think we got some room to clear out the trade pile too, boys. 
I wanted to see Pavetta start. Yeah, Pavetta's a baller, man. It's just, uh, look, Leeds got an insane amount of, ma of amazing players. Dude, Rafinha looked so good for us. I know we lost, but he looked so good for us again. How do you clear this out again? So we're at 100 items. Down to 66. Pack opening still going, boys. Let's go. Yeah, Pavetta is nuts, but I mean, honestly, Helder Costa, Jack Harrison's crazy, Rafinha's looking amazing, Pavetta's a baller, like, we're so spoiled with, like, the attacking width in the team right now that it's just, it's always going to be unfortunate when a couple of these players don't start for us. I love Pavetta, man. He's such a great kid, too. Like, if you see him in interviews and stuff, he's just always smiling. Him and Calvin are, like, best friends. Hey, Batch. Um. Hey, Nick. Are you happy right now? How dare you? You know he is only 20k, right? Also, Nick, did you know that Sway is happy? Kappa. I do. All right, we got Mega Packs. So, I believe two of them are from Gold 3, and one of them is from, as well, from Rivals Rank 1. So, let's see. We went untra- oh, we, Sorry, we went tradable, plus the Gold 3 rewards. Let's see if we can keep making a bit of coins here. No walkout, no boards on the first Mega, so we can skip that. Okay. There's Mukieli. Do I do I use him? Like, should I use him? Is he up in price because he's needed? He's not really that much up in price. Is he needed at all? I need to assist with a defender, right? So maybe we use him. Maybe we fit him into the team. Yeah, he's like he's like it's like he's like kind of needed, but not really. If that makes sense. Makes things easier if you do use him. So we'll use him and then we can sell him after. No big deal. Eh, Odin's not worth anything. French defender in the Bundesliga. He's useful. Eh, get that gone. Discard. Discard your face, dude. I don't know what that means, but we're moving. We're motoring and moving. I think I said we're Morvin. Nice. Good English. You won't need a French defender once you pack Laporte in the next pack. Dude, that would be so sick. Uh, the best part is it's all tradable too, which is pretty awesome. I think we've got like two or three uh, uh, more un untradable packs. Actually, you know what? I don't know. Maybe we don't. The rest might all be tradable, which is pretty exciting. The 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 mini 50k pack. Hey, Batch. No joke, I try to live my life as way does. That man finds happiness in everything he does. Even though he the same age as Gandalf, he's got a child's happiness and I love it. That's kind of true, isn't it? Okay, so he discards for 250. I think I'm just going to discard. We'll save this for selling later. Uh, none of this sells. None of this sells. Catalysts are like 400 coins, for God's sakes. To the point where I'm going to put this on Mukieli. Why not? Will help us out a little bit. Because um, I'm going to bring him into the right mid and then just spam crosses with him. And hopefully we can get, get some goals for his objective. Um... Seria could be useful, so we'll keep that. Also, we got Belgian Tifo. No one's gonna, no one's gonna buy any of that stuff. I, I don't think these sell either, genuinely. So we'll just, we'll just get rid. Don't have much room in the trade pile, anyways. Okay, so prime gold player. Uh, we'll just get these first. Megas first, boys. No walkout. No boards. Man, Megas are trash, dude. Have Megas been good for you guys? Oh my god, so terrible. Servers are back. There you go, boys. And now we're in 10 uh, minutes into, the, uh, hey, into the promo. They're back. The ketchup song. Mukil, Mukil, Jade, Hey, Tejup, Tu, Jeb, Sabai, You, Noob, Majabi, and Boogie, and Bui, Didipi, Mukil. Jade, Hey, Tejup, Tu, Jeb, Sabai, You, Noob, Majabi, and Boogie, and Bui, Didipi. Okay. Thank you for that, Dono. Okay. 
Okay, so let's see if the Russian League players are still worth much. Not really. Not for me on PC, they aren't good. I can't seem to do well with uh, with Megas. I don't think a single Mega Pack has paid out this year. But I can't... Hey, man, they, they, I guess it's, as always, if the luck is in, right? We packed him... Um, we packed Team of the Year Frankie de Jong last year on the Poor Man account uh, from a Mega. So... Oh, that was a League SBC Mega, but still, God, League SBC is so fun. So fun, dude. Thoughts on OnlyFans? A real question. What are my thoughts on OnlyFans? If it's legal and you can earn a living, live your life. You know? Do, do what you want to do, do what you got to do. I mean, I obviously hope I, I raise my daughter with enough love for herself and her, her loved ones and, you know, her eventual kids and stuff like that to, to value her body enough to not want to do stuff like that. But, you know, hey, Batch. that's as far as it goes. I'm also not going to hate hey, guys, EA stuff here. Like that. We it's released a promo at 1 p.m. EST. You like this promo, guys? Wait, no one can get on the servers. Oh sorry we have servers from 1990 and refuse to upgrade to save the money when we have money flowing out of our ass. Well enjoy the promo guys and of course make sure to buy FIFA points so I can buy my new Lambo and not put a dollar towards the game. <laughs> okay, well, uh, <laughs> thank you for that Hellboy. Appreciate it. Everton kits might be uh, up there. Alright, I mean is is the owl worth anything right now? Not uh, Do I really want to jam up the trade pile? Isn't he like... He's 250. Dude, did I just list him up? Wait, what? Oh, nice. Pack within a pack. Did I just list him up for 100 coins profit, man? I want your OnlyFans. The, hey, the deal was the deal, boys. Deal was the deal. You guys all know where the deal is. For my OnlyFans. That's three megas. Nothing. Hey, Batch. Two from the gold three and one from uh, Nick, rank one rewards. can you rewards. create a non-livans where you post yourself in some sexy lumberjack gear while chopping down some wood? Sure. There's the sweetheart again, man. I can't get away from Connor Cody, dude. Why does he have to be so damn nice? God. So annoying. Wow, he's also discard. Oh, Wolves fans don't seem to care. That's crazy. That's someone like Gamero's discard. Diallo worth a little bit still? Nope. Wow. Rip the market. Servers aren't back at all? Well, that sucks, boys. Sorry to hear. I Like, this guy just won't sell. I guarantee you I could list him 30 times and he won't sell, so... Unbelievably, I will be just discarding that dude. I mean, for God's sakes, I don't even think Stark is gonna sell. If you don't pack a big boy, you might as well discard the whole pack. I disagree. That's idiotic. Running a no FIFA point poor man road to glory where every little coin counts? Hell no, dude. But that's the same guy that will then in a week be like, Hey, how do you- why do you have so many coins? I sit here and go with untradeables and then discard all the duplicates, but like, how does Nick have so many coins? I don't get it. <laughs> Alright. Bang, 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 bang. Cam to center forward. Woo! Wait, are they actually... Okay, hold on. So we're back up to 100. <laughs> Down to 91. Damn it, dude. Trade pile's actually getting full. Trade pile legit getting full. Okay. Well, this is where things get annoying. Um, See, like, I, I feel like that would sell, but the market's so broken that pe pe Wolves fans can't even go search. They can't even go search for that themselves. Okay, so we got a gold pack. I guess that was the pack within the pack. We can rip that. 
Lots of people not on FIFA. Yeah. Servers are still a mess, so don't worry, guys. It's not like the servers are better right now because there's no one on the game. They're still an absolute dis disgraziato. All right. Hey, Batch. EA here update on the servers the hamsters we having giving us electricity for the servers died from starvation. We got to feed them for a week so we are sorry and we are going to Petco to go buy new hamsters. Chris, D. Shalta, Hellboy, Goose Goose Goose, Fetty, Damien. Much love, boys. Thank you, thank you. Bad we can't grind weekend league. We can't do anything right now. Cannot do anything right now, dude. Okay. What we can do, though, I, I mean, I could get one more pack open, I believe. Go see what the uh, what the trade pile's saying. A couple more sales in the trade pile, so. Okay. I need to relist anything? Nope. Alright, let's get let's get one more and then we'll um we only have four packs left anyway, so it's all good. They're all the good ones though. So let's get one more. Maybe the untradeable one? Small prime goal player pack. Here we go. So this is the mini 50k pack from one of the UCL midweek things. These usually are sick packs. The board. Oh. I guess it's SBC eventual fodder. Not a bad card though. I didn't even know Callihan was at Fiorentina, honestly. Right, Bauer, thank you for the 26, man. Appreciate you. And yeah, that's all gonna be SBC fodder. Okay. We can do one more. We can do Uno Mouse. So one from uh, rank one, one from gold three, right? And this is from rank one as well. Let's see. Come on, Prime. These have been ass for me this year too. No, no, oh my God, dude. No walkout, no board. Feels bad, man. So weird to not see a Napoli badge, yep. You worth anything, sir? Wow, man. Holy. Why? I feel like I'm tempted to hold because of, like, the necessity for these types of cards for when the UCL uh, comes out. I'm going to hold them. I'm going to hold them. I just feel like, like, come next Tuesday, he'll be worth uh, at least a little bit more than discard. Maybe not, but feels like he'd be worth a little bit more than discard. Dude, these prices are nuts. Um, huh. I mean, Smalling's card isn't really that good, so I don't know why I'm surprised he's discard, but... Same with Condoglia. It's not like he's a great card. Please help me connect to EA servers, Nick. I mean, you can use all the caps you want, but I don't know... Where or how you think I work for or with EA, brother. I have <laughs> I have no say in that, my dude. I've just been on the servers, so I, I I guess I got lucky enough to get in. For defender assist, can I play my center back at striker? Yes. Yep. I'll be moving like Mukieli up to uh right mid. You try for some bids right now nah not gonna be much not gonna be much there dude all right 100 trade pile items again clear it we got three more boys let's go who is gonna be sold here oh this guy is worth discard that's crazy please help me nick i can't, guys i would love to i would love to don't get me wrong it's not like i don't want to help you Okay, we'll discard this dude. So, trade pile's jacked up again, boys. Now it's hey, time batch. to try this Mukieli thing. EA executive here. Really bad for us right now. Petco is out of hamsters and we're missing out on the FIFA points from those dumb idiots. I mean, loyal customers. Anyway, going to try PetSmart. <laughs> oh, God. Chat, you guys are another reason why I think EA hates my guts. You guys troll as much as I do. So any of the EA bigwigs that happen to be in my stream every once in a while are like, oh, God. 
Here's this, here's this jerk. Here's this jerk in his jerk chat again. You're closest to EA though? I don't know. I don't know how you think that changes anything, brother. It, it doesn't. So we need to figure out how to do two things at once, okay? So once again, you guys have to do all of this, okay? I'm not remembering anything. Assist four goals with crosses with a Bundesliga player, okay? So that's just RB, uh, R1 square against D1 skill-based matchmaking sweat lords. Sick. Uh, hey, Batch. Assist five goals using I love French this defenders. Community. So same thing. Same thing. Assist four and five. So that we can cut, you can kind of do both of these at once. I've got Mukieli, so we're going to try it. We'll give him a catalyst as well. Hey, Batch. Uh, score in six separate matches using it's French the players. So we're going to use... We pretended um, to die as EA are Mbappe fucking donkeys. And, uh, what's Best of luck to whichever hamster so replaces us. using Bundesliga players and live foot friendlies. Okay. Hey, Batch. So I guess I'll Nick, score with a French player and then for Eric sub on. on the transfer market and I cannot find him. Check Laporte's Twitter for the full story, lol. EA fed up. I mean, I, yeah, I, I, yeah, that doesn't surprise me, brother. Win six matches. Scored with 12, 12 goals with Bundesliga players. Okay, so we'll try and get the goal with a French player, with the assist with a French player, with the assist from a cross. <laughs> so Mukieli sending in crosses to Mbappe and, um, uh, Cantona. And then... Once that happens, we'll sub on, I guess, two Bundesliga attackers if I have them. I did just sell Jade and Sancho, lol. Uh, score 12 goals, because then we got to score 12 goals with Bundesliga players. And then we just got to win uh, in six matches. So that's kind of chill. And then if we go down to this one, just as a look here. This is squad battles. We got to score with Serie A players. Oh, that's squad battles. Win five matches with at least one Italian player that plays in the Serie A. Okay. So I'll, I'll maybe try and get a link between Del Piero. Assist using Italian midfielder. So if I make it... Uh, if I make Del Piero a cam, are we chilling? Would that work? I need an... Oh, this is going to be weird, isn't it? Hey. No, it has to be packed as a midfielder. That's not correct. That's incredibly wrong. Um, okay, so how are we going to do this? How are we going to do this? We're going to start with... Um, these two up top. Wait, where the hell is Del Piero? Did I not get Del Piero? Wait, Del Piero is the reward? You get him if you win. That's the reward. A five-game loan Del Piero after a week. Oh, dude, I legit thought... Well, I'm also an idiot. I legit thought it was you get that card at... Oh, yikes. I'm an idiot. I'm just so dumb. I thought you got that card as a start hey, to back. the challenge. Does that make sense? Delp is the reward you batch in 28. Ha ha. Whatever, dude. Okay. Uh... Hey, batch. Guys, check Marcus Rashford's retweet and show some love. Whatever team you support, he is just showing the whole world humanity exists. Enjoy watching you from India, Nick. Um. Mubot read that idiotically. Uh, enjoy watching you from India, Nick. GG. Thanks, bro. Friendlies are... Wait, friendlies are now fully disabled? EA literally just tweeted, We've temporarily disabled match creation in all FIFA titles while we investigate reports. Guys, they're cramping on my epi, dude! God, these guys are so... Just so <laughs> silly, dude. <laughs> oh, I guess we're gonna do bronze packs. I don't, I don't know... I don't know what else we can do. Anyways, I'll piece this together on my own then, dude. Sorry, YouTube. I thought we were gonna I thought I was gonna be able to show you guys some cool stuff here with Mukieli hey, and, and, and building a really, really sweet team. Take my bits, bro. F E A. Hey, thanks, BBL. Appreciate you. Alright, well hey, YouTube, I'm so sorry, man. 
You want new servers? Ha ha ha. We are only worth $36 billion. But buy more FIFA points and we will continue to work on it. Oh, jeez. Well. The good news from the rewards today is we're quite a bit richer. 16, 60... Uh, like close to 750k once they sell plus all of this other stuff of course so we're doing we're doing really well man rewards i mean we're we're not bad put it that way they weren't amazing but they they weren't bad so to end off the epi i i guess i'm sorry youtube i wanted to build a cool team and then and and then go into um uh go into the fut friendlies I, I was actually planning on playing maybe a couple of uh, uh champs games but as ea have tweeted They've completely killed matchmaking across everything. I've got six or seven games of rivals to play. I've got up to five wins to play on the poor man for champs. I've got five wins that I still need to achieve on the rich man. Uh, and then we've got Mukieli to grind. And now they, they've just killed... I, man. You know what? What will we say? Without trying to be too toxic, I believe... Is that Baz Doss the actual footballer? No, that's a... That's a uh, that's a that's a what do you call it a football twitter account anyways i guess the positive outlook here is without just crapping on everything ea are doing is video games are hard to run i guess so i love you guys i appreciate you guys let's open our uh tradable rare player pack from rank one rewards haven't hit a screen player yet don't expect it from this but maybe something sellable no walkout no boards. Nice! Cool, man. Danilo Pereira, dude. You know what? I can't even be excited about Pepe. Not because I want to be toxic, but because the fact that he's like 900 coins. Anyways, Ollie Watkins, please don't smash us in... 30 minutes at least we have the Leeds Villa game to watch <laughs> hopefully we do well and that doesn't end poorly for me either so I get even more batchy and toxic anyways um oh my god dude these cards are just all discard 900 coins what do you mean he's 72 million okay well not to me at least Oh my goodness. The rune, same thing, has got to be near discard, right? Uh, so we'll, we'll store him for now. Miranda. Miranda used to be like 3 4k. Crazy. Leeds game isn't even televised in the UK. We get it in Canada. We get every Premier League game in Canada. All for one low price of like $20 a month. Whereas you guys are getting absolutely rinsed by your own government and by the greedy... I don't know if it's the Premier League itself or what, but the fact that people in the UK have to pay like $20 for a random game is pathetic. When me across the world in Western North America, uh, I can get the game. No problem. It's, it's pathetic. And you know what it is, boys. I'll end this thought for you guys here. It's the television companies that are scum. Why are they scum? Because it's COVID right now and nobody can go to games. So these games that cost you $20 a pop, if it was regular times right now, you could just say, screw you, I'll go to the game. I'll go watch the game or I'll go to the pub or I'll go somewhere with friends and watch it. Everything is in lockdown and all of these gross mafia-esque television companies know that so if you want to watch the game you have no choice but to pay the $20 but I hope you do what a lot of teams fans are doing and they're not paying it and they're donating what they would pay to charity Leeds fans are doing that today apparently as well I think Leicester fans did it I think Villa fans did it so you can make a stand yourselves boys um you know I, I wish there was some way I could help you guys out from Canada obviously I can't legally that just wouldn't work but uh, I feel for you guys, man. Absolutely pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. Um, all right. Anyway, so we'll end it here with the final pack. We're back up to 100 items in the trade pile. Here we go. Gold three, boys. Was it worth 
the effort number one and was it worth saving the packs okay it's a board at least it's no 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 rule breaker wow that's oh my god that's so awful so we end the episode with a 10k discard yaboa not the leads yaboa i wish it was tony yaboa um, I guess in a Grimaldo who I'm probably going to save because he's what? 3k. Yeah, I'll hold on to Grimaldo. So there it is, boys. Uh, another week of weekend league rewards. Red player picks were atrocious. And I know we got Koulibaly and, and, um, Jaden Sancho. So we made a little bit of money back, but in terms of something fun to use in our squad, it's another week of getting nothing good. So thank God that we're playing for fun on this poor man road to glory account and packing good things doesn't even really matter we can just continue and have fun and buy the players that we want to so on that bombshell we'll catch you on the flip side wish leads some luck i hope we can do well against a shit hot aston villa squad in the next 30 minutes twitch.tv slash nick 28t i'll be live at least until midnight uk if you wanted to jump in um bye and we'll catch you on the flip side peace